Hello everyone, my name is Lindsay. I'm a tutor with RD Bootcamp and today I'm going to be going through a practice equation for full time equivalent or FTEs for the dietitian exam. So get a piece of paper, pencil and calculator and let's do this. Okay, here's our practice question. Seven employees left the kitchen staff this month. You need to fill the positions as soon as possible. Three of the employees worked full-time and four of them worked part-time. One part-time employee worked six hour shifts and three part-time employees worked four hour shifts. How many FTEs is this? Now pause this video and try to work this out on your own. So go ahead and pause it. All right. Let's find out if you got the right answer. Okay, so the first thing that we do is find the total labor hours worked per day. And first we're gonna start with the full-time employees. How can we figure out how many hours the full-time employees are working per day? Well, we have three full-time employees and each of them are working eight hours per day. So while each of them are working eight hours per day, cumulatively, the amount of labor hours that are being put in, 24. So three times eight is the 24 hours that are being worked by the full-time employees each day. What's next? We wanna find the total labor hours worked per part-time employee. So we have one part-time employee that's working six hours a day. So that's one employee times six is six hours three part-time employees working four hours a day, three times four is 12. So this is the amount of hours that the part-time employees are working. What's next? We're gonna add together all of the labor hours worked per day for all of the employees, both full-time and part-time. Here we have, we have the six hours, 12 hours and 24 hours that we just came up with. And if you add them all together, we get 42 hours per day of how many total labor hours everyone is working each day. Here's a nice visualization for people who are more visual learners. We have seven full employees. Um, then we have three of them, which are part-time, three of them that are full-time and four of them that are part-time. And of the three full-time employees, each of them is working these eight hours. The four time part-time employees, one is working six, and three more are working four hours. So we're adding together all of these hours to get 42 hours of labor per day. Next up, what we wanna do is divide the 42 hours by eight hour days. And we come up with this number, 5.25 FTEs per day. Did you get that number? Well, if you are curious about what an FTE is, if you want to figure out how to calculate the FTEs per week or per year for that same question, feel free to head over to rdbootcamp.com. We have private tutoring and we also have group classes. You can use this coupon code PASS10 to get a discount and I hope to see you soon.